So now we have an inverse Luigi's Mansion. Like, now it's... Like, you know what's here's, yeah. you know what's funny? The soul is not changed if he plays in the Luigi mode. Yeah. And it, make, and it makes some hilarious the uh, like dialogue. <laughs> yeah, Luigi has to save Luigi. It's pretty good. Also, I like the creepy like ghost stuff going on in the in the skybox. I like it when you. One of my favorite one of my favorite ghost scenes is actually when you actually get to the ca inside. <laughs> yeah. The yeah. It's like a was it? I I think it. Don't they call it like Waltz of the Booze or something like that? I have no idea. Research, research time. Yeah, so there, there is, there is, very nice thing. I, I know 3D Land like reuses it, and then 3D World I think makes a new theme, which is nice. I don't know which one I prefer, but they're both pretty good. Rolling around at the speed of sound. The places to go got to own all the money. <laughs> yeah, here we go. This is the thing. Daboos. Yeah, cool yeah they have a different boot. Have a different boot cry in this one. Yeah, I think this is also a callback to a sixty, a thing in sixty-four that. Got cut. I know in like you can find in like early beta screenshots that some of the booths were originally going to hold keys, and that just never was a thing in in the game. I don't even I don't even think 64 DS. Is that what that. they is that what they referenced at the start of Luigi's Mansion? <laughs> I don't know, maybe. <laughs> oh hi. Yeah, go take the light. So yeah, the um. So why are there candles? Yeah right. They really like the smell of the wax. It's more of a it's more of a puzzle though to uh, kill booze because you can't just ground pound them anymore, or like kick them from behind. You need to just lure them into searchlights and whatnot. So I keep on forgetting Mario can actually like throw down in sixty four. Yeah, I guess we may as well mention this as well. There, there's unused animations for like punching and kicks for this game. And I guess they just thought it was that would have been redundant with the spin move, so it just got cut. Which is fair enough, I guess. Mini <laughs> triple that calls, huh? Yes. And then there's also th th this is all coming from the Beta 64 video, which I mentioned in an earlier part, I think. But they, for some reason, there's unused and really crappy looking, <laughs> like sports game animations so yeah i don't really know what that's about <laughs> like you, you you look at some of these like like animations if it looks like mario's arms are like falling apart or something <laughs> can, you, can you ground pound that yes you can whoa yes very so, fast just a bunch of cars. I actually don't think I've been in here. Yeah, I, I don't usually see people go in this room. It's kind of pointless because coins don't really matter in this game, but hey, okay. it's cool. Kind of a neat room, actually. I feel like the, there should have been like something more in here. Like, if not the like the secret star, just instead of having coins, that should have been star bits. What's the difference? Is they both get you one ups. Well, yeah, what- well, Star bits are necessary currency. <laughs> yeah, the more star bits you can get, the more, like, you don't have to worry about the Hungry Lumas. Hi, Weege. Just another day in Mario, Luigi. but the dialogue oh, box has help. Yeah, just another day in Luigi. Get ready to pull up, get ready to pull up. Oh, good. Ah! Yep. I can imagine that's a little hard with the, with this kind of pointer. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit weird. How the heck did Luigi even wind up here? I yes! Don't, it's, it's just a regular Tuesday for him, I guess. <laughs> He's written booish. He's written booish. Nice. That's a language. And now we have a very weird power. Boo Mario. I remember this- <laughs> 
Wait, what? His face. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I remember them getting more out of this power up in the second game. I don't remember what they do with it in this game. Scare what does the sign say? Because you're. What does the oh. sign say? Because bluish. <laughs> bluish. <laughs> it's funny. Oh, so just control. Controls. By the way, light makes you lose the power up. Yeah. Holy crosses also make you lose the power up. Oh yeah, pressing uh, yeah, pressing Z L also like makes you go down as well. Well, it makes you go down faster. I'll ride this, but oh, no. oh, oh, boos apparently are infatuated by you. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I don't swing that way. Oh wait, I should have. Nah, nah, I messed up. No, no, I should have stayed as a boo because it gives you funny dialogue. Oh, well. He's just like, oh yeah, he's just like, no. Yeah, it's basically the same thing as like Captain Toad getting scared by B Mario. If you're playing the Luigi mode, when you get here, it's the Luigi, so it's like, audio, me? Yeah. It's really weird. Oh, I, didn't know I, had a I didn't know I had a twin brother. Wait, if Luigi had a power star, shouldn't they have taken him back to the observatory? Yeah. He found, he found it while I was here. Well, no, well, Mario's the one who needs to pick it. Oh, Mario's the one who needs to collect it. <laughs> yeah. The star just seems like oh, it's the it's the observatory star, so it should have taken Luigi here immediately. Well, he didn't know where to go. The star yeah. should have known, though. <laughs> also, it would have been nice if Luigi followed him along. Oh, that well, would be nice. Well, at this point, the stars feel more like they're in his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And yes, he actually does help you get power stars. Well, sort of. Only like <laughs> three of them. <laughs> Hey, he tries. Uh, yeah, I mean, well, yeah, he's putting in more effort than the toads. <laughs> yeah. The toads at least show up in more places. <laughs> yeah, and they're useless. I mean, if you, if you want, like, a playable character, you're probably not going to do much in a, a Mario game. <laughs> Hi, Weege. Bro, oh, you're looking at my power stars, right? That's me help. It's always surreal seeing it with, like, an actual dialogue box. Yeah. I think about it, that's what I go there, Galaxy. If I find it, I'll write you a letter. Keep your eyes peeled for it. Yes. Alright. Bye! Okay. So you just kind of have to wait, and then the uh, male toad will sometimes just g gives you a, a, a letter with just, Luigi found a star here, find him. And... You a, actually, now I think, yeah. actually, since we were talking about the Brigade a moment ago, how did they get back from the poison swamp? I don't know. Uh, they, Mario yeah. retrieved them on his way back, I don't know. Or, or they just or, managed to fix the ship eventually, I don't know. So wait, Luigi finds stars, but he never... He seems to always get kind of just stuck. Like... If he's been on, like, if he's set from the observe... Excuse me. If he set foot on the observatory at any point, then if he finds a starting it should just take him back, but gameplay. Uh, I'm gonna yeah, game. I'm gonna assume that I'm, I'm what I'm at, I'm gonna assume in this case is that it's the it's the tow brigade carrying him off. Probably. Oh, this one's actually kind of a weird one. They bring this guy back in Galaxy 2, don't they? Uh maybe? Or am I thinking about a later level? There's definitely another level where you race him in this game. I don't know if he appears again in two though. It's like Ghost Sprint Galaxy. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Where you had to race them as Boo Mario. Yeah. It Captain. Yeah. Captain Toad looks naked without like his headlamp. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, <laughs> I can see what you mean. He's just Toad. That's not Captain Toad. That's just Toad. So I think that is. Yeah. This is. Yeah. That's a secret star. We're not doing that. Oh, that's a secret. <laughs> they did a really good job hiding it. Yeah. Because I know it, that... that. Like, oh god, that's a story ending of shit. <laughs> a little bit. Yeah, th yeah, that rock is either just star bits or one-up or the launch star. Man, it... I mentioned it before, but it... Like, just going through all these levels, it really just goes to show how much they really, like, put the pull star mechanic to, like full use, I guess, because we've been using that a lot. 
Yeah. It's a rule to judge people by their appearance as toads. How can you be scared of the booze? They're adorable. They're ghosts. <laughs> I know, but I mean, they probably are, they probably are like terrifying in the Mario universe, but I'm not even sure about terrifying in the universe because like like Luigi's Mansion and like Thousand Year Door have shown like what really scary ghosts look like. <laughs> yeah, I mean they've made. I mean, they've made it apparent that, like, the booze are, booze are supposed to be, like, the most dangerous, but they're not necessarily the most terrifying. I, I like how they have all these bones and, like, there's just, like, some mutton in floating in space. Yeah. Bone meat. It's bone meat. Yes. But they don't have, like, a dry bone skull, like, a dry bone skull just oh, guys. floating around. Oh, guys. No, 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 no. Cheater! Yes. That's the one who can go through walls! Yeah, right? I do like the- the- Okay, control's being a bit weird there. Go, do, go, 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 go! I do Catching like the, 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 the races in this game do require some actual effort, because the ones in- The ones in 64 and Sunshine aren't really that difficult at all, besides maybe- What is it? The- The last one in- Sunshine, but even then, it's not that bad. I feel like the ones. Oh, in... you did it! Oh, you differently when I did it. Yeah. Well, yeah. The the ones in. I shoot! I shoot! I shoot the bombs and just go through. <laughs> oh, I see. Um, the. Yeah, the the races in, oh. in the races in Galaxy. I feel they make it more of a point to have the AI actually put up more of a fight, so it doesn't feel. Like you're waiting like 30 seconds <laughs> for the uh. I think, Louis, I think yeah. Luigi already found one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it works fast. Power back here. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a ladder from Luigi. But oh, I got a saw, but now I can't get back. This picture shows where I am. Help me. <laughs> yeah. He can't get back. He can't get back when he got the star. It's like Rosalina's magic blocking him from returning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, don't I mean, know. that would be funny. So, I paused the game, I wanna see. Yeah, Mario just has, like, main character privilege. <laughs> yeah, you just have the... Uh, you always have this so you forget you can just do that. Even though I always do this as soon as I show up. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you, you drop everything. You're supposed to drop everything for Luigi. Oh, yes. Go save my Mario, boy. if you bring him back and he gets lost again, I... I won't let him return. <laughs> yes. I think with this, actually, this is... That's the one who... Yeah. As he does it two more times. <laughs> yeah. I think with this, this is gonna be... Clearing up the terrace until post-game now. Right, okay, we still got the purple comet. Yeah. And he's literally... I like how you just see him. <laughs> yeah, he's literally at the start, so you just kind of triple jump and win. What if Luigi was, oh, like, like stuck in it? Hmm? You just get the cutscenes of him when you're on the fly-in. He has done. He's done that before. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. No, you, what if you, would you? You can you can skip yeah. you can skip. The, yeah, you can skip the cutscene where like the uh, it shows the galaxy. You, you can't skip. I don't. What? Well, I don't know if you can skip like Mario flying in, but. Um, I'm pretty sure you can. I feel like it's best. It's usually best not to though because you can pick up star bits during it. Hi. Well, we wow, how did you ever get here? You <laughs> never saved me yet again. I knew I could cut out you, bro. <laughs> yeah. What? The power star. Yeah, I got it right here. Yeah. Did you find a spine while you were here? <laughs> how did you carry it in your pocket? It's, it's as big as your. It's it's as big as you are. Chaos Emerald logic. Pretty much. Hammer space. So it so it shuts up his ass. Yeah. Yes. Basically. I like, yeah, I like wait, the, wait, what did he say? It's a <laughs> Yeah, he just said Luigi. I, like, I, I love how he just photobombs the victory screen. Yeah, I like that. It's even funnier than Luigi, bro, because it's two Luigis. Yeah. Even in his own, like, campaign, Luigi has to save himself. Like, there's something meta about that. Um, that said, I still think the funny troll- I still remember the funny troll logic that, uh, Chica Conroy did for his, uh, Galaxy Let's Play. Like, oh, so yeah. long ago. He said, he said, like, um, uh, I will never get, uh, let's play Mario Galaxy. So what does he do? Luigi Galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, Isn't it one of, like, 
His Onio. That's one of his oldest LPs. Yeah. When was that? Yeah, that that's that's the LP that got me introduced to him. Hmm. Also, 1997. No. He did the exact. Yes. <laughs> he did the yeah. There it is. He did the exact same thing for his Mario uh for his Mario 64 Let's Play. He didn't do yeah. He said, "Oh, I won't do Mario 64." So what does he do? 64 DS. Of oh, course. Well, see, I just did that because now we have the star bit count of the, the um. Yeah, speaking of 64, <laughs> the star bit count is now the release date or, or the release year of uh, Mario 64. Um, oh, b uh, Boulder Geist. Uh. <laughs> do we want to do Boulder Geist or do the secret? Yes. I'll leave it to Scrappy this time. Oh, gosh. My computer cut it out. Go to do the regular star. Okay. Uh, this guy's not that bad until you until you're doing the uh, the daredevils. Yeah. You're a daredevil run. This guy kicked my ass. <laughs> yeah, I remember that be this being one of the tougher ones. Oh, so this is I'm a um, flying. This is a, I guess a thing that you probably wouldn't know if you don't talk to the toad. But yeah, the Luigi. Oh, uh, so that's how we, that's how he got trapped there. Yeah. So uh, yeah. Um, Luigi got kidnapped by Bouldergeist. Um, How did he get kidnapped in the same place twice? <laughs> I don't know. The thing is, the, no, 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 no. He's not kidnapped now. Well, the, the thing is, like, the the game doesn't really make it too clear unless you talk to the Toad, because you never actually see Luigi in the level. So, yeah, as far as you don't talk to the Toad, as far as you know, this is just a random boss. I mean, I, I must guess. Still, well, no, Luigi didn't get kidnapped again. He's just. Uh... He's saying that's how he got kidnapped. Well, I mean, he was in Maybe. trouble here earlier, so like... Oh, is that what the... He said he, he said no. get kidnapped twice. I'm like, that's how. <laughs> okay, I... Okay, so... Mm. Okay, fair enough. I guess that makes sense, but... Also... That would imply... Oh, hmm? These guys. Yeah, there. yeah, I don't know. What are they called? Boob bombs? Something like that. Yeah, th this is basically just um, yeah. get used to this mechanic because you're going to be using this for the boss. They look like freaky little things. things. Yeah. Bomboos, okay. Bombos. They go boom. They look boo like boo bombs. Sounds a boo bomb sounds a lot funnier. Yeah, I I know there's no reason to do this. I I mean obviously I I'm not doing it now because pro controller, but. Uh, on the Wii, I always used to, like, like lightly s uh, swing the Wii remote around while I had the, the, the bomboos. I know, I know it doesn't matter, but I just kind of like doing that. I think if you do it, yeah, if you wait. Stop it. I'll eventually talk about the health system, but there's too much stuff going on in this video game. <laughs> uh, okay. I thought there was one up there. I think you can see the, 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 the sling star a little bit from behind before you even come in here. <laughs> yeah. That's a big black hole. Um, this is and not in the good way. It's like a uh, like 2D section. What, what would be the good way, Jason? Good. Uh, go ahead, go on the internet, Scrappy. <laughs> <laughs> I was... I, and I'm not, go I'm not going any further than that. <laughs> okay, before I talk about the, the health system, I do want to point this out. This is something I've wanted to mention for a while, but... Um, one thing I've never been the biggest fan of... Good. Uh, the biggest right. fan of with, uh, <laughs> with Mario games for the most part is the fact that they tend to boot you out of levels um, when you die, and you have to like manually jump in, which... It's not the worst thing in the world, but when you do the harder levels, it does get a bit tedious. And I like that the Galaxy games are one of the few that doesn't do that. It just you just go back to a, the checkpoint, and I feel like that should just be more of a standard with these games. I feel like it's just inconvenient to. Can this guy die? <laughs> uh, it, it's just kind of inconvenient to have to like manually jump back in every time. I feel like they could fix it really easily in, say, like the 2D games, for instance, where. 
Oh no, you die in like Mario Wii, and instead of having to like... Hold on, I need to aim this. I mean, this. I don't think it's much of an issue in the 2D games, because they actually remember your checkpoints. <laughs> As long as you don't leave no, that's for a not different really, level entirely. That's not necessarily my issue. I'm not like getting like having the checkpoints is isn't the issue. It's, it's more of just I'd rather they like you die and then it just it, on the loading screen to ha have it so you can still like use items. Just have it a thing where you're in the loading screen and you just you just press plus or something and like the your items will show up. So you can just do that before you load back in, and press, I don't know, another button if you want to leave the level entirely. I feel like something like that would make a lot more sense and ruin the, or not ruin, um, and fix the slight tedium. It's not the worst thing in the world, like I said, but again, when you go into levels where you're struggling, it, it just kind of gets in the way, I think. So, I like that these games don't do that. Playing dad, what were we talking about? Health? No, um, I was talking about getting booted out, booted out of levels once you die. Oh, in oh. Mario games. Oh, like, uh, right, okay. Ah! <laughs> I think what makes it more egregious. Good. <laughs> Can you, like. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Get, I, um. What is it? Uh, what makes it more egregious is when you play game, like, other games. Like that dude just like put you back in the level. Over us playing Tokyo Mirage sessions. Indeed. Yeah. But either way, though, it's it's not the biggest deal in the world, but it's just something I wanted to talk about. Do you, yeah. Do you guys do you guys have like any? Favorite like specific like music tracks in this game. The obvious one, the the, the one obvious one comes to mind first. <laughs> yeah. The one that ever uh, literally everybody in the in their grandmother loves. Yeah, I think. I think it's. Um, I don't pretty, even use it. Is. I think it's pretty much required for us to uh, like uh, showcase that theme. I'll be sure to belch loudly when it starts. <laughs> And I'll be sure to sing along as that possible. Yes. Not just sing along. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm gonna take my chances. I want to keep the starbirds. Well, lives lost later. I mean, uh, you do, like... You spawn next to the guy. Yeah, so if I really need the lives, I, I'll just spend it. But... Hey, welcome to ha probably hardest boss in the game. <laughs> I don't know if I'd go that far, but he's definitely one of the tougher ones. You know, it's a good thing they provided the context of Luigi apparently being kidnapped, because... Yeah. Uh, otherwise, it'd just be Mario kind of attacking again, random fauna. Yeah. Well, again, well, again he has the power star, so... We don't... we wouldn't know that otherwise. We, no one told us this. The well, Sargon th told us this. Yeah. I mean, I guess with this guy, he's... He's more. He definitely looks more like, like evil villain kind of thing. But the thing with uh, some of the other guys, like, I don't know. There's nothing stopping Mario from just asking, like, hey, big, okay. big mole. <laughs> well, yeah. the, the, okay, okay, we antagonize the mole. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, there's. What's what's stopping Mario from just asking the dude, just, hey, can I have, can I have your power star? <laughs> Mario I don't think Mario talk. can speak. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah, Mario can right. talk properly. Yeah, this is the this is the typical Nintendo head and hands kind of boss. At least this time, actually wait. I mean, yeah, I guess there's. A... Yeah, I don't know. This this is that's just the thing. Yeah. They really love these kind of bosses. Yeah. Punch. Punch! Fucking punch. I think this boss, uh, make, it took a recording time just so we could be sure for Scrappy's sake. Uh, it, right now I'm looking at it, it's like 54 minutes. Careful. Yeah, they can't- oh god. They'll explode eventually. <laughs> yeah. Ah. 
In these stressful times, we all we're all about to explode eventually. Yes. You want me to explode? Yes! Alright. Gay! You are gonna finish your dessert and you are gonna like it! Yeah! <laughs> How's that? That's the one I meant, you particle brain! This is a good one. That's good. I heard Scrappy Snicker got that. <laughs> yeah, I heard that too. <laughs> No, 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 no. Oh god, I forgot how borderline him. suicidal they get when they are about to blow up. The thing that. The thing with the hands that's the most annoying, really, is the fact that. Not necessarily their attacks, it's the fact that it, it makes it really hard to actually get hits in. What's this, a Mario boss that only does in two hits? Yeah. I mean, I think that's fair enough, because it takes a while to, like, break the, um. The rocks. Also, uh, I I tend to star bit shoot the rocks when and when he hold hold them up. Oh yeah, you can shoot them with the star bits, yeah. Especially yeah, when he's doing the thing where he's like, like setting the rocks up. His hands aren't close enough to the ground, so you can so you can just hit him like that. <laughs> yeah. All right, secret start time. Yep. Then we'll do- then we'll do Bully Base. I guess so. I don't know if- I, I don't know if we'll have time to finish this whole dome today, because it is, like, getting really late. Hmm. I was hoping to get a, a dome done a session. Uh, well, I- I mentioned this in- in DMs, but the, it is coming to the point where the- the domes are getting longer and longer, so this not gonna be forever. And then there's also stuff we gotta mix in, like Luigi. Yeah. Not to mention comments and whatnot. So I'm just happy EAD finally realized Luigi existed in 3D games. I did not mean to jump on that bat, but I'll take it. So this is a cool area. I, it's like, you follow the, follow the path. Oh, that's right! Yeah, this is cool. This is basically the... Early version of the Yoshi power up in Gal <laughs> Galaxy 2. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I forgot about that. It's a cool little obstacle course, if you will. I know there's another level in like one of the la last domes in the game that's just pretty much another version of this that's like. I don't know. The stuff like this is just why the Galaxy games are so cool because it has. They have all these like, fun level design ideas that keeps things fresh. It's... I mentioned it before, but there's really a dull moment in these games, and considering how many levels there are, like, it feels like there's always something new going on, which I like. Like, even... Even in this one level, there's been so much stuff going on, and... Yeah, I love it. <laughs> a lot of variety, per, even being per star. Yeah. That's uh, while while it's kind of a shame you can't go, you can't really go out of order with stars. It's like, at least you can, at least each star has its own individual ch real challenge. Yeah, I like that. The uh, yeah, we kind of we sort of mentioned this before, but I do like how they recontextualize the star system, like the Buu system, I guess, where it you're doing every like every star is basically its own like, obstacle course, so it doesn't feel, like, that egregious compared to Sunshine or especially 64, so... You're basically just, yeah. each galaxy is basically just a little world in itself, you're just yeah. going through the, you're just going through the levels in order. Yeah, like, if this, if this was, like, si like 64, then we, this would, oh, okay, let's... <laughs> It, yeah, it is. <laughs> it is a sixty-four. Ghost of the Galaxy would have would have been like one big level, or like it would have been like one dome or something. But yeah. Mm. Let's see the comments here. Don't know. I'm still convinced that those are random. <laughs> oh God. Do we really, oh god. Do we really want to do um, this now? Booey base. Booey base. Do it. 
We we no, we just did this. Let's not. Yeah. Do it. Uh, how about no? Yeah. High fuckable. Yeah. 